Paige Hadley, after almost two years of hard work, the World Youth Netball Championships are just around the corner. Can you believe they're almost here? I actually can't because it's scary because that's actually my 21st birthday as well. So I can't believe it's all happening and uh, I'm so excited for it to start and just get out there and hit the court in Glasgow. Now, since uh, you've left the New South Wales Swifts uh, team huddle uh, earlier this year, you've been deep into preparations with the Australian Institute of Sport. Uh, what has the team been working on ahead of the World Cup? Yeah, so I um, moved down to Canberra so we could all be together and um, train day in, day out together. And obviously we've just been working on um, team strategies and um, the combinations that we're going to come up against and obviously um, New Zealand and the different um, styles we're going to come up against. So we've been doing a bit of that and uh, obviously preparing for A&L because obviously we don't go in there to lose a game. So we want to win and go into Glasgow with uh, some wins under our, under our belt. You were just in Australian Diamonds camp and there are a few previous t uh, Australian 21 and under uh, members in there in that side. Did they offer you any advice heading into Glasgow? Yeah, um, I heard a few stories. So I heard, you know, um, two, the one, or eight years ago now, the one about the lights turned off um, in their semi-final, so not to let the ball go if it goes dark. And um, then obviously the last time when they came out and just uh, absolutely gave it to New Zealand and, ho and came away with the win. So um, yeah, I heard some stories and um, it was a good insight into the World Youth Cup. You've previously said it's been a, a massive goal of yours to actually make the team for the Australian 21s. What would it mean to you to take away the gold medal uh, for the World Youth Cup? Oh, it would mean so much. You know, that, that three years of preparation coming down to, you know, one game maybe and, you know, I just hope it comes our way and, um, you know, it would just top put the cherry on top of my cake for this year, you know, getting that gold medal and um, knowing that all that three years of hard work and that sacrifice that we've all put in um, came down to that gold medal. Thank <music> you.